I love them to learn. You don't love something if you don't earn it. Yeah. And so like, even when they're, when they get their first car, you pay for half of it, get a job mm-hmm. and, and learn that self-worth that that gives you. That's yeah. awesome. You also had the energy to go to Disney World with your grandkids at Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Some people might call that insane, but <laughs> how was it? And what, what is the best part about being a grandmother now? Do you know, I was blown away at the energy I had. So not just, I still have kids that aren't married. And so my 23 year old is like the biggest boy you've ever met in your life. And he was like, mom, let's go and shut down Disney together. So we were like running on the rise as they were closing at like 11 or 12 or whatever it was. And he goes, mom, you're so fun. I wasn't that fun when I was heavy. I was not, I couldn't, I was, I took the pictures. I wasn't in them. Mm -hmm. I was keeping up with them. My grandkids were having fun. Yeah. I'm a fun grandma because, you know, I, I just posted a picture of a quilt I made and one of the comments was, I can't even sit on the floor like that. I'm like, yes, you can. Don't give up. You are in there. I had all those excuses. Oh, my bones are bigger. Oh, my, my body's different. Your body's in there. Yeah. You just have to love it out again and take care of yourself. Absolutely. And it's it's really doable. It's like if I can motivate one person to find that health in their life, it's totally worth everything that I do with Nutrisystem. It, it's a game changer. Yeah, yeah. I saw the quilt. It's beautiful. What a fun hobby that oh. is. <laughs> um, do any of the grandkids take after you musically? Do you see it yet? Well, I have a son who is extremely talented. And uh, my grandchildren, they're all very musical. They're math, math, they're smart. But I tell them, I go, you know, just have a real job. Just, I never, honestly, I'm kind of an exception and not a rule. This is not to have a 60 year career where you have worked consistently your whole life is not normal. No, it's not. <laughs> I never thought I would be still doing things. Yeah. My, this last Christmas tour, I honestly was the most fun show I think I've ever done in my life. And I was doing it with symphonies and it was so fun. And and I love bringing joy to people, but I think I'm I'm much more balanced now because I'm not the sole provider and I don't have to do that. And so I'm playing as much as I'm working. And I'm having my husband just called me and goes pack your bags we're going on a trip and I'm like okay. <laughs> <laughs> and um, you know I, I have a motorcycle. I love to do that. I love to do my crafts. I love to be with my friends. I love to work. I. I love doing this to help people find their best selves. I think that women love to help other women and to, to, to teach what we have learned through life. And I've had, I've had quite a life, you know? And so I love sharing things that I know are positive and healthy. Mm -hmm. That's great. Well, you made the news a few, I think in 2020, because you said that you were not leaving money to your kids. Is that? Yeah. I thought that was so funny. Um, did your kids react to that? Did they already know, or what was their reaction? Oh, my my oldest boy said his friend called him and he said, "Man, it must suck to be you." And <laughs> <laughs> I, to me, honestly, why would you enable your child to not try to be something? Yeah, I don't know anybody who who becomes anything if they're just handed money. To me, the greatest gift you can give your child is a passion to search out who they are inside and to work. I mean, I've done so many things from designing dolls, you know, whatever. I mean, I just, I'm nuts. I love trying, I wanna try everything. I'm a finisher. That's one of my rules with my kids. If you start it, you finish it. You don't ever have to do it again, Mm -hmm. but you gotta finish. And um, I just, I just think all it does is breed laziness and entitlement. And um, I worked hard and I'm gonna spend it all and have fun with my husband. Awesome. I'm actually going to leave a lot of it to help people. So of course, of course. Yeah. Well, then I don't not help my children. I mean, they need help with a car or something, you know. Yeah. But I, I love them to learn. You don't love something if you don't earn it. Yeah. And so, like, even when they're when they get their first car, you pay for half of it. Get a job mm-hmm. and and learn that self worth that that gives you. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I stand by that too. That's great. Um, Your husband and you, you know, you were at Disney together, I believe. I saw a picture. Um, How is this marriage? I know it's the second time you've married him. How does it work, you know, for you guys? What's the secret? You do kind of keep it a little bit private. Is that is that your secret? Well, I think it's important. You know, I think that you can get super public and that's not healthy either. But, you know, he's very he's private. I love that. 
Uh, I guess my blonde wig made the press. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I have a red, I have a purple. I, I do all these. My husband goes, so who are you today? And it's fun and it saves my hair, especially when I'm like doing a lot of shows. I don't burn my hair. But, um, and it's, it's kind of fun. You know, it's a little incognito. But um, we, I'm so grateful. He's my best friend. And I think if I were to say to anyone, I think especially when you raise your children, keep dating your spouse. That's why you got married to begin with. Yeah. And because the children are going to grow up, they're going to go away. And it's the two of you. And I'm just so grateful, uh, so grateful to be happy. I, I had some really tough years and, um, and everybody does. No complaining, no nothing. But um, my, my, my son the other day, he goes, Mom, you're Job. You've been through everything Job's been through. <laughs> I'm like, I guess I have. But he says, I'm going to call you Jobus. <laughs> but I think that's the beauty of life is the more you go through, the more you appreciate it. That's kind of where I am now is with my, my husband is we're so grateful to have found each other again. Yeah. And so we just, you don't know, you don't know how long life is. Mm -hmm. And so you just, you live it the best you can and have fun together. We're very simple. We don't need a lot, you know, yeah. we'll go camping, hot dogs. We don't care. We, we just have fun being together.